Communities across Canada have been affected by wildfires, including here in Quebec. And the federal government expects the amount of forest burned to double in the coming decades. Canada has to adapt, and it's looking up, way up, to get ready for what's coming. More efficient, less expensive, faster, more agile, and better coverage. The Canadian Space Agency is developing a way to track and monitor wildfires from orbit. It's called the Wildfire Sat Mission, and we're learning more about how it will work. A Canadian company will come up with a design for seven microsatellites that are planned to launch in time for the 2029 wildfire season. Which will be a public asset for Canadians to you know, protect ourselves and our communities and our allies around the world. Satellites are becoming smaller and it's an innovation. We are at a technological point where we know we can deploy these to meet our needs rapidly. They'll use special infrared sensors to take thermal snapshots of fire zones and give crews better data to fight these fires. The orbit of these satellites will allow monitoring in the late afternoon, which is a peak burn period. And when we do send people, they will already have information to be able to know what's coming as opposed to going uh, going in the dark like they often have to do now. And it's not just fires. Wildfire Sat will help predict the direction of smoke, which cities like Montreal have had to deal with. The Canadian Space Agency says this will be the first publicly owned fleet of fire monitoring satellites. Along with the seven active monitoring satellites, two backups will also be in orbit when the project launches. A test satellite will be built first for a planned test mission in 2027.